what's up guys it's zed and this is episode 23 of the how to create a player series on fc25 so in this video we have something a little bit special i'm creating a subscriber as you guys have already seen from the title of the video and before i go into the video i just want to say that i did this three times and the second one i did which is this looked um it was the closest in my opinion to what jordan actually looks like but i lost the save file for the second one so um i tried my best to to try and make it look as good as the second one but um i think it still looks pretty good just not as good though but i mean it still looks pretty good in my opinion so i hope you like it and let's get into the video all right so we have jordan powell kid number two from the united states plays for manchester united born in 2001 october 24 he is 5'6 and 165 pounds and a right footed right back then for his creation i started with this as the base player this is what i use as a base player so we're moving to his skin so we have skin tone 3 complexion 6 skin surface 4 then for everything else after that it's all on none so we're not touching anything in regards to the lip makeup face makeup rosacea any of that so we're moving on to the head right now we have the custom forehead so i basically didn't even use this part i went straight to the advanced sculpting which is double clicking y if you're on xbox and if you're on playstation it's um triangle yeah so i double click straight up to go to advanced sculpt so i just cycled through the whole thing like this i didn't touch anything on the outside so we're going to start with the head basically and before i go into this it's actually a lot more complicated than the other ones i do because i'm creating an actual human being and you know, we actually do not have perfectly symmetrical faces and shit so there's going to be a lot of editing to the right side of his face and the left side of his face but let's just move on from now so feel free to pause the video and copy the sliders to your character so we're starting with the skull the skull crown, the skull back, the temples, and then back to the skull. Then for the flesh, we have just the temples. But then I didn't work on the right and left side for the head and the forehead, or that just for the head. So I'm moving on from the flesh to the fat. We have nothing under the fat. Then for the forehead, we're going to start with the skeletal and then we have the upper forehead the lower forehead and i think i actually did something here all right so this is the right side for the lower forehead and the left side for the lower forehead so you're going to have to pause a lot just to get all of this because i don't want to spend too much time on each so let's go back to both so upper forehead lower forehead then for the flesh there's none and then for the fat we have the forehead center and then the forehead sides so for the forehead side this is the right side and this is the left side so the difference isn't really that much but it's it's there then moving on to the eyebrows we have the skeletal the eyebrows are right side and left side so the difference is just in the width so that's narrow and widen so make those changes that for the eyebrow center then the eyebrows outside top this is the right side and this is the left side then for the eyebrows okay we're back to the eyebrows basically so then for the flesh we have the eyebrow center this is the right side and this is the left side then for the eyebrow gap the eyebrow center okay we're back to the eyebrow center all right so it's sorry if i'm sounding very confused because <laughs> this is just the first time i'm actually editing these like both sides of the face so yeah then for the parts we have nothing other the fat for the eyebrows then moving on to the eyes this is kind of the complicated part so we're starting with the eyes under the skeletal then the eye sockets that's pretty much it for the eyes then for the flesh, this is where you have to pay a lot of attention. So for the flesh, we're starting with the right side, or the eyelid fold center rather, but it's the right side. And then this is the left side. 
stand for the eyelid fold outer this is the left side and this is the right side so there isn't really a difference for this then for the eyelid fold inner this is the right side and this is the left side not really a difference for this as well for the eyelid lower center this is the left side and this is the right side for the eyelid lower outer this is the right side and this is the left side so no difference with this one the eyelid lower inner this is the left side and this is the right side so it's a slight it's a slight difference then for the eyelid upper center this is the right side and this is the left side and then for the eyelid upper outer this is the left side and this is the right side then the eyelid upper inner this is the right side and this is the left side then the eye corner outer this is the left side and this is the right side and for the eye corner inner this is the right side and this is the left side then back to the eyelid fold center so we're done with the flesh for the eyes i'm sorry if it's really complicated and i actually made the eyes are where i kind of had an issue with at first but um i mean this is the best i could come up with for now so for the fat we have the eyelid upper this is the left side and this is the right side so it's pretty much the same for the eyelid lower we have the right side and the left side and for the under eye lower we have the left side and then the right side that is pretty much it for the eyes we're moving on to the ears so for the ears we have i didn't really like make any difference between the right side and the left side so everything here is just both sides of the ears so this is the ears under the skeletal then for the flesh we have the ear outside top let's zoom into the ears here the ears outside top the ear outside middle the ear outside bottom the ear inside top ear inside bottom the ear lobe and the ear tragus i don't know if it's pronounced as tragus or tragus but yeah it's that then for the ear outside top that's back to the beginning then for the fat we have the ear outside top and the ear outside bottom so that's pretty much it for the ears moving to the nose we have the let's zoom out a little bit then we have we're starting with the nose under the skeletal then the nose bridge sides this is the right side and this is the left side then for the nose bridge center and the nose bridge upper and back to the nose then moving on to the flesh we have the nostril upper this is the left side and this is the right side so there's not really a difference for the nostril upper outer this is the right side and this is the left side not really a difference as well thing is i'm not sure which sides i made um a difference with so i'm just going to, to go through everything so that i don't miss anything out so for the nostril upper center this is the left side and this is the right side no difference at all so the nostril lower this is the right side and this is the left side no difference as well again for the nostril outside outer this is the left side and this is the right side then for the nostril outside center this is the right side and this is the left side the nose tip under there's no right or left side here for the nose tip under none as well for here the nose tip lower then the nostril upper then i think we're back that's the beginning already so i'm moving on to the parts it's just one option which is the nose so that's pretty much it for the nose the next up is the cheeks we're going to start with the skeletal this is the left side and this is the right side so there's a difference in the height of the cheeks for this one then for the flesh we have the cheeks this is the right side and this is the left side so there's a slight difference then for the upper outside cheeks this is the left side and this is the right side no difference for this one the upper inside eyes this is the um, right side and this is the left side then the upper inside cheeks this is the left side and this is the right side 
the lower outside cheeks there's not going to be a difference with this one as well then the lower inside cheeks not going to be a difference for this one as well then back to the cheeks then moving on to the fat we have the upper cheeks this is the right side and this is the left side not a difference here then the lower cheeks this is the right side and the left side then for the jaw this is the left side and this is the right side so there's a slight difference for the cheeks inside upper this is the right side and this is the left side the cheeks inside lower the left side and then the right side then to the temples we have the temples is like the temples give me a bit of an issue like both the temples on the forehead the skull and the cheeks give me give me a bit of an issue but we move so this is the temple this is the right side and this is the left side then for these okay so we're back to the skeletal wait what the temples then all right so that's pretty much it for the cheeks then moving on to the mouth we have just the mouth the teeth i didn't really touch the teeth at all like i didn't touch it at all then we have the mouth the chin and the jaw left then we'll be done so for the mouth we have the skeletal then for the mouth the mouth outside top this is the left side and this is the right side not a difference then back to the mouth so the flesh we have the mouth corners this is the right side and this is the left side for the lip gap center we have nothing the lip gap sides this is the left side this is the right side then for the lip, upper lip top center the upper lip top sides this is the right side and this is the left side the upper lip top corners this is the left side and this is the right side the upper lip bottom center the upper lip bottom sides this is the right side and this is the left side upper lip fullness this is the left side and this is the right side then for the filtrum this is okay it's just one side that they have then for the filtrum then to the lower lip fullness this is the right side and this is the left side then the lower lip top center the lower lip top sides the lower lip bottom center the lower lip bottom sides this is the left side and this is the right side then the lower lip bottom corners this is the right side and this is the left side the mouth corner grooves and there's no right or left for this one so that's pretty much it for the flesh under the mouth then for the fat we have the mouth sides this is the left side and this is the right side then the upper lip this is the right side and, and this is the left side sorry then the lower lip which is the last for the mouth this is the left side and the right side so there's no difference between these two so moving on to the teeth yeah we're not touching the teeth at all you guys can do anything you want to do with it if you want to and then for the chin which is the second to the last we have the skeletal and under that we have the chin i didn't really touch the left or right side for this one so it's pretty straightforward so this is the chin the upper chin and then back to the chin then for the flesh we have the chin cleft and the chin sides then for the fat we have just the chin the under chin and then back to the chin right so it's just those two so we're moving on to the last thing which is the jaw it's not a lot of options under this one as well so we're starting with the jaw under skeletal inside jaw top inside jaw bottom and then back to the jaw then for the flesh we have just the jaw and then this is the right side and this is the left side so for the fat we have just the jaw as well this is the left side and this is the right side so it's a slight difference but that is pretty much it for the advanced sculpt for Jordan, for Jordan Powell 
so moving on to his face he has the light brown eyes then we already done with all of this and all so moving to his hair he has medium brown then the hairstyle is the hairstyle 18 which is this is the closest thing to his hair that i could pick up then the eyebrow and facial hair color is medium brown the eyebrows are 174 straight and low art then the facial hair is 238 is also the closest to what he had on so that's pretty much it for his face and then if you're interested in looking at the kits this is the waist fit untucked the key sleeves are undershirts the jersey fit is on normal the player boots he's wearing the nike wait what he's wearing the nike luna alpha elites and then the kid socks are on average the ankle tape is on none three then the gloves he's not wearing any gloves any um um tapes and all that nothing so i'm moving on to the animation his goal celebration is the salute and then his free kick style is the run on toes the penalty kick style is the pianist which is pretty much it's close to what the king one looks like but i actually like that one as well so for the running style he has the el pato on and yeah that's pretty much it for jordan powell so if you have enjoyed this video make sure to hit the like button and subscribe to my channel if you haven't already if you want to create yourself as well i'm thinking of starting a membership program on my channel so that um, i would um, prioritize the members for creating their lookalikes or something like that but i would i would sort out the details for all that later on but um, anyways drop your comments on what you think does it look like jordan or not um, i would most likely try this again for someone else